नमस्कार माई नेम इज़ प्रियंका शर्मा एंड टूडे सब्जेक्ट इज हाउ टू ग्रो योर हेयर्स देर आर सो मैनी रीजन्स टू फॉर द हेयर लॉस फर्स्ट कुड बी स्ट्रेस सेकेंड कुड बी लैक ऑफ वॉटर कंजम्पन इन योर बॉडी एंड थर्ड कुड बी लैक ऑफ ब्लड सर्कुलेशन इन योर स्कल सो विल टेक थ्री आसनास how to increase the blood circulation to your scalp and how to improve your hair growth so let us start with the first asana called uttanasana or padasthasana so we need to stand for that so uh, we keep some distance between our feet we take a deep breath in raise your arms up and when we exhale we push our hip back and we try to move with straight going down we try to touch our toes or we place our palms near our feet and rest your neck and relax your shoulders if this becomes quite difficult you can fold your knee initially and then you can move your then you can rest your spine on your thighs and relax your neck so this will improve your blood circulation to your scalp and it is very good for hair growth second asana is known as shashank asana or rapid pose or child's pose in very easy term so for that we need to sit in vajrasan like this your knees slightly apart your big toes touching together like this uh, so you can just see big toes touching together your knees apart and when we raise our arms up and then breathe out we rest our spine on the floor we relax our belly our chest and our head in between that gap of our knees and rest your head so we relax here for 5 minutes every day which will reduce the high blood uh, those who are suffering from high blood pressure it's very good for them also it improves the blood circulation to your scalp and it is very good to cool down your mind so whenever you feel anxiety anxious you can just relax in this posture for 5 minutes every day if this becomes difficult you can also put cushion under your uh, between your knees and then relax on the cushion or pillow and the third asana is uh, known as sarvangasana or shoulder stand for that we need to lie down on our spinal cord and then we raise our both the feet up towards the sky or ceiling and then we lift our backbone up towards the ceiling or sky and then we hold our back or we hold our mid back try to squeeze your hips your knees straight and for little more advance you need to push your chin to collar bone and your toes are pointing up towards the ceiling or sky we gaze to our toes we keep our knees straight and we are on our shoulders and our elbow support and we stay here every day for 5 minutes then we come back slowly relax your arms relax your spine and then you can hug your knees and relax your neck you can loosen up your neck if this becomes very difficult you can also use a viprit karni or you can use your both the legs like this for 90 degree angle and this is for beginners you can stay here for 10 to 15 minutes every day if this becomes very difficult you can also use the wall support and you can keep your legs hanging for 5 minutes every day with the support of the wall so uh, these are some basic three postures which we perform this sarvangasana or shoulder stand is very good for your eyesight and improving blood circulation to your skull also it improves your concentration because the focus is very important here and it also strengthens your shoulders and your neck so it is very uh, uh, best asana for improving your circulation so i hope you like this video and you share it out and you comment below if you like this video and for more details you can definitely comment below thank you namaste